Hey y'all, I'm Mickey Gousset. In today's video, we are going to cover the fundamentals of GitHub Advanced Security, or GAS as it's commonly called. If you're a developer or part of a security team looking to understand what GAS is, how its components work, and how they fit into your development workflow, this video is for you. We'll keep this straightforward and focused on what you actually need to know. And I'm going to sprinkle some quizzes throughout the video to help with learning retention. Let's start with the basics. GitHub Advanced Security is a suite of security tools designed to help developers find and fix vulnerabilities directly in their development workflow. The key word here is developer first. These aren't security tools that slow you down or require you to leave your GitHub environment. GAS consists of three core components, code scanning, secret scanning, and dependency review. These work together to protect different aspects of your code and development process. Now, here's what makes GAS different from traditional security tools. It's automated, it integrates directly into GitHub, and it's designed to catch security issues before they reach production. Most features are actually free for public repositories, but you'll need a license for your private repositories. Okay, first quiz is coming up on the screen now. Pause the video and put your answers in a comment below. Let's dive into the first component, code scanning. Code scanning analyzes your source code to find security vulnerabilities and coding errors before you deploy. It uses static analysis, which means it examines your code without actually running it. Now, the primary engine behind code scanning is CodeQL, GitHub's own semantic code analysis engine. But you're not limited to CodeQL. You can also integrate third-party tools that output results in a serif format. Code scanning can be configured to run in a variety of different conditions, such as on events like pushes and pull requests. When it finds potential issues, it creates alerts directly in your repository, which are visible through the security tab. And the best part, it integrates with GitHub Copilot Autofix, which can automatically suggest fixes for the vulnerabilities that it finds. The second component is secret scanning. This one's crucial for preventing credential leaks. Secret scanning automatically searches your entire repository, including your Git history, issues, and pull requests for sensitive information such as API keys, tokens, and passwords. It currently detects over 200 different types of secrets and works with about 150 different service providers through GitHub's partner program. When a secret is detected, GitHub can even notify the service provider directly so they can take action like revoking the credentials. You can also create your own regular expressions for secrets that you want to detect. But here's the really powerful part, push protection. This feature prevents developers from committing secrets in the first place by blocking the pushes that contain detected secrets. It's proactive security that stops the problems before they start. The third component is dependency review, which focuses on your software supply chain security. This feature helps you understand how dependency changes in pull requests might impact your security posture. When someone creates a pull request that modifies package manifests or lock files, dependency review will tell you if any of those dependencies have known vulnerabilities, and you can use that to block the merging of the pull request. This is particularly valuable because it catches supply chain risks before they're merged into your main branch. It's much easier to address a vulnerable dependency in a pull request than to deal with it after it's already in production. Okay, the second quiz is incoming. Let's see if you are paying attention. Again, pause the video and put your answers in a comment below. Now, you might be wondering if you need all three components or if you can get them individually. And good news, as of April 2025, GitHub has unbundled GAS into two separate products. You can now purchase GitHub Secret Protection for $19 per month per active committer, which includes secret scanning and push protection, or GitHub Code Security for $30 per month per active committer, which includes code scanning, dependency review, and Copilot Autofix. 
This means you can start with just secret scanning if that's your biggest concern, or focus on code scanning if that's where you see the most value. You're no longer required to purchase the full GAS bundle. Now let's talk about how GAS actually fits into your daily development workflow, because this integration is what makes it practical to use. First, everything can be automated or just happens automatically. Once enabled, code scanning runs on pushes and pull requests, for example, without any manual intervention. Secret scanning happens constantly in the background. And dependency review? Well, it can be configured to run when a pull request is created. The key is that developers don't need to leave GitHub or learn new tools. All alerts appear in the security tab of your repository, and they're designed to provide actionable information. You can see exactly where the issue is, why it's a problem, and in many cases, get suggested fixes from Copilot Autofix. For teams using GitHub Actions for CI/CD, GAS integrates seamlessly into your existing workflows. You can even customize when scans run and how results are handled. For teams that don't use GitHub Actions, there is a CodeQL CLI that you can use to integrate scans into your CI/CD environment. So what's the real value proposition here? GAS addresses three fundamental problems that every development team faces. First, it shifts security left in your development process. Instead of finding vulnerabilities in production or during separate security reviews, you can catch them while you're actively writing code. Second, it reduces the friction typically associated with security tools. Because everything is integrated into GitHub, developers don't need to learn new interfaces or interrupt their workflow. And third, it's comprehensive. You're not just getting one type of security scanning. You're covering code vulnerabilities, credential leaks, and supply chain risks all in one integrated solution. Last quiz for this video. You can do it. Pause the video and add your answers as a comment below. To wrap up, GitHub Advanced Security gives you three essential security capabilities. Code scanning for vulnerabilities, secret scanning for credential protection, and dependency review for supply chain security. These work together in your existing GitHub workflow to catch security issues early and keep your code secure. Whether you need all three components or want to start with just secret protection or code security, GAS provides a developer-friendly approach to application security that doesn't slow down your development process. If you found this video helpful, please consider liking the video and subscribing to the channel. And share with your friends. Every little bit helps to get my content in front of more people. Thanks for watching.